It's Monday, June 17th. You can just see some of the flowers starting to come up. There's some cosmos coming up over there. And one Armenian cucumber. The radishes are coming up and so are all the eggplants. There's eggplant. Eggplant. This is yellow squash. Two came up here, three over here. Some of the marigolds are starting to pop. That's acorn squash over there. The second seeding did a lot better. This is the banana peppers. There's one popped up, so the rest of them should pop up today or tomorrow. And over another bed too. Those are all turnips. They're coming up. No cucumbers yet. And the trellis. There's radishes and then eggplants as well. The eggplant. Two and three, so they're all popping up. The zucchini I just had to replant again because the seeds were mushy on the inside. So I just um, I cut off the tip of the seed to see if that helps it to germinate. And then again, cosmos are starting to come up. The acorn squash. None of the kale has come up yet, but there's a volunteer green beans. <clears throat> Got my funny contraption hooked up with the screens to try to keep <coughs> the, uh, the bugs off of the squash working so far. Got the sweet potato slips planted in there and of course within a couple of days then all of a sudden it decided to get really really hot but they're surviving. A bunch of radish. The yellow squash hasn't come through in there. I did replant them. Most of the beets have been eaten off. But the cucumbers are starting to do better. They're trellising. The cucamelon made its way over to the trellis. So it'll start growing quickly. Green beans. Or these are wax beans. The jalapeno peppers are starting to take off. The okra is starting to go. I am still getting random asparagus beans everywhere. <coughs> but the flowers are doing good. There is some Bermuda grass in here that I'm going to go through today and pull. Strawberries and asparagus are growing well. Still putting off random strawberries. I just gave it a really good watering yesterday. <coughs> so we'll probably put off some more. Roma tomatoes are doing good. A little bit more okra there. The loofah is starting to do really well. Starting to trellis up <coughs> on both sides. It's doing well. I'm going to plant that today. And then green peppers and tomatoes are doing good. Terry helped me get the trellises together this year. He put the poles up. I restrung them with some different string 
and so like this one comes down and wraps around the plant and then it's got a stake tied to the bottom at the, the little staple type big staple at the bottom <coughs> I need a few more of them to finish that one because there's three tomato plants per section here because these are large cherry tomatoes and I need to go through and pull the suckers off those today when I do the strings. So it's got good flower sets. And then, as I went through, I just pulled the suckers off. So there's some, there's some more, and these, those are all just big pep, uh, beef steak, and there's another one. So I'm just going to get those to keep going, and then hopefully as these die off, I can have other ones to replant. We've got the marigolds in the pot still. One thing, the onions, they are fairly big underneath the soil, which is pretty neat. They're big under there. You know, you can't really see it. Oh, there's another volunteer green bean. <coughs> but all the green beans on the trellis, they're starting to flower. So. They should be putting on green beans within the next couple days. We'll be able to eat some for dinner. Fresh green beans. These obviously we have I have to water this. The tower pretty frequently it dries out but it's okay to keep extra strawberry plants I don't mind doing it and then I have to plant in these but everything's coming along pretty well for being June 17th <coughs> <coughs> 